sniper ambush. Oh, God damn it. Oh, shit, not now. Smell it. <sighs> Gotta be getting close. Sorry. 
Sorry, you goddamn freak. Tell you something. Hey, it's okay. It's just my nerve. You told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I. None of us knew it was going to go like this. It's fast. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey, I'm not losing anyone. I made a promise. Remember? Deacon, wait. Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. Come on. It's that bad. Okay, what? Okay. Just hold this here as soon as you can. Mm. Right. I don't think so. I think I can walk. Mm. Good enough. I'm almost there. Okay. Mm. Two hours ago, this place was calling the feds. Mm, yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They must have bugged the hell. Uh. Yeah, she's burning up. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning sick. Mm. Hmm. Sister. So stupid. It was this little, this little kid. This, this goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Shit. Your mom. You want to be able to come through? We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. All right. See if you can rest over here. Hey. Easy, easy. She reminded me so much of my little sister, you know? Because we used to play that hide and seek game all the time. And she would just, just hide her head in her coat just like that. I've been cutting my name, but nothing like that. She's burning up. I'm gonna go that way. Ah, uh, come on. All right, hey, sweetheart, can you move? Close your head. Yeah, I got her. Go find this way out. Nothing, go, go. Got this, go. Hold on, go. Fuck you! Yeah, we see you got guns, guys. Stop shooting. Sir? Hey, 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 I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Get out! Now listen to me, listen to me. My girl's out there, she's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out There's out a helicopter you right her. So listen. You killed just... my wife! Look, I, I didn't know anything about you. I'm sorry, sir. Dude, he didn't do anything. 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 He didn't
What's wrong? Let's go. Wait. Oh, okay. Listen, O'Brien. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. <laughs> Oh, come on, no more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteered for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. <laughs> Shit. I, I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why do you got room for two of you? We're over. Wait, okay? I can only take two of you. Two. <laughs> come on, now. Come on, help me. Come on. All right, sweetheart. It's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. You're gonna be right back. Okay, Boozer, let's go. We gotta get on that guy. We gotta get on that I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Look, I've been through worse shit than this before. You know? Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never going to make it without me. I'll be back. Which way? <laughs> Still got this. Did it. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Today, I was thinking about where it all began. Now let's go deep. Back to the big WW2. 1947, the feds passed a, what they call it, the National Security Act. Now, what this did was give the feds the right to take over our roads, railroads, and radio. Anything they damn well pleased. Without a warrant. Today, the feds are gone. But we're still here. Shining the spotlight of truth on the world. Truth is, 
I seen it coming. Huh? Years ago, we <laughs> had photos. Nero death camps built to hold us, American citizens. No one believed me. If more of us had spoken up, none of this would have happened. Tell you one thing, it won't happen again. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Well, you're right about one thing, Cope. All these Nero refugee camps, they did turn out to be death camps. Just not the way you were expecting. <laughs> Finish burning out this infestation zone. Boozer, you got that bounties. It's the only reason that I go up. Hold on, hold on, they're slowing down. 
Looks like they're stopping. I mean, if they were trying to hit me, I would be dead. Dick, remember me telling you about that death wish years? Yeah, 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 I got this. Dick it out. Get back here with that! Oh, shit, that's mine! So, what the hell are they doing? Looked like they were out here. Shit, wrangling freaks, I don't know. They had a newt and some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? What do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wild... Bug the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't... you don't think that Sarah... No! No, not, I, I, I... I don't know. I'm just... and he's alive, Boozer, he's alive. O'Brien! One of them, Nero. I'm gonna track him down. If I can, I, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. Okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? Hey, 
Hey. So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the old Belknap Road and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? Oh, <laughs> that's great. That is just perfect. <laughs> that is great. That is great. So about those directions? <laughs> I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Bel Belknap. Belknap, that's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then? <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. Hey! <sighs> <All right. laughs> could you use a ride? Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. <clears throat> um, I don't know, how do I, uh, this contraption? Pretty much what you think, you just throw your just... leg over, yeah. Okay, um, there. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hold on tight. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I know what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. No idea what research was. Sorry, um, I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. Hey, hey, look out! Shit! Assholes! <laughs> oh my god. Are you okay? I'm just... Oh, Lordy, that was close. Hey. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I've got cell phone reception. Hey. Yeah, I'm fine. I just... The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um, I don't know, some, I don't know where Road I am. Road 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, they'd be happy to give you a ride, so. <laughs> okay, all right. All right, I just... There'll be any minute now, All right, so... all right, all right, screw it, let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> you weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. So you're not from around here. No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they just, they opened this lab here, so here I came to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so the company that I work for, they, they do work for this bioengineering firm, and um, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare, and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. What the hell? Clay, we got company. Oh, shit. All right, gentlemen.
A biker, huh? Yeah! Yes, hit him again! Now you like that bike, my boy? Come on, hit him! Not so tough now, Him. <laughs> Oh, you don't learn, do you, you bike boy? boy? Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, teach him. teach good. Yeah, you like that? How about that? Oh, shit! Oh, I'm out! Hold on, hold on! Hold on! Roll, goddammit! Roll! Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh, oh, my God. Hey. I'm so sorry. No, no, no. I, I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag and no, I, I saw right. that and I. Oh. oh my god, I could have killed somebody. Well. Oh shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kind of aim it at them first. See, I've never done anything like that before. Hey, I saw, it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw going. it in They're your going. bag and I just I tried to call you the did police, good. but there were no You know what we're gonna, no gonna do? We're gonna do no reception. I'm gonna wait right here until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? Tucker, Hot Springs Camp, you there? I'm gonna need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon, I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait, he mentioned the Who was that? That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack, yeah, extended no. pancakes, yeah, I know. Okay, I'll start there. You do that, and remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could use. Keep that in mind. Deacon out. How many drifters you guys murdered today, huh? Yeah, I can tell by looking at you. Oh! 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 